Are you embarking on a treatment journey with rituximab and concerned about potential side effects? In this comprehensive guide, we will decode the side effects of rituximab, empowering you to better manage your treatment experience. Rituximab is a widely used medication for various conditions, including lymphoma and rheumatoid arthritis. While this drug can be highly effective in combating these diseases, it is essential to be aware of its potential side effects. By understanding these side effects and having the necessary knowledge, you can take proactive steps to mitigate their impact and ensure a smoother treatment journey. Common Side Effects of Rituximab Rituximab, like any medication, may cause side effects in some individuals. It is important to note that not everyone experiences these side effects, and their severity can vary from person to person. The most common side effects associated with rituximab include fatigue, nausea, and infusion reactions. Fatigue Fatigue is a prevalent side effect reported by many patients undergoing rituximab treatment. It may manifest as a general sense of tiredness, lack of energy, or excessive sleepiness. Fatigue can significantly impact your daily activities and quality of life. To manage fatigue, it is crucial to prioritize rest and sleep, practice good sleep hygiene, and conserve energy by pacing yourself throughout the day. Engaging in light physical activity, such as gentle stretching or short walks, can also help combat fatigue. Consulting with your healthcare provider about any persistent or debilitating fatigue is essential to rule out other underlying causes. Nausea Nausea is another common side effect experienced by individuals receiving rituximab. It may occur during or shortly after the infusion or persist for a few days. To alleviate nausea, your healthcare provider may prescribe anti-nausea medications or recommend dietary changes. Eating small, frequent meals and avoiding spicy, greasy, or heavy foods can help reduce nausea. It is important to stay hydrated by drinking plenty of fluids, but avoid consuming large amounts in one sitting. If nausea persists or worsens, notify your healthcare provider for further evaluation and management. Infusion reactions. Infusion reactions are relatively common during rituximab treatment. These reactions can occur during or shortly after the infusion and may include symptoms such as fever, chills, rash, itching, and difficulty breathing. Mild infusion reactions are usually manageable and can be treated with medications, such as antihistamines or corticosteroids, as recommended by your healthcare provider. Severe infusion reactions are rare but can be life-threatening. If you experience severe symptoms, such as difficulty breathing or swelling of the face, throat, or tongue, seek immediate medical attention. It is important to inform your healthcare team about any previous infusion reactions or known allergies before starting rituximab treatment. Managing and minimizing common side effects. While experiencing side effects can be challenging, there are strategies you can employ to manage and minimize their impact on your daily life. Here are some tips to help you navigate common side effects associated with rituximab treatment. Fatigue management. Prioritize rest and sleep. Allow yourself enough time for quality sleep and incorporate short rest periods throughout the day. Conserve energy. Pace yourself and avoid overexertion. Break tasks into smaller, manageable segments and delegate when possible. Practice stress reduction techniques. Engage in activities that help reduce stress, such as meditation, deep breathing exercises, or listening to calming music. Maintain a balanced diet. Eating a nutritious diet can help combat fatigue. Include fruits, vegetables, whole grains, and lean proteins in your meals. Stay hydrated. Drink an adequate amount of water throughout the day to prevent dehydration, which can contribute to fatigue. Coping with nausea. Follow dietary recommendations. Avoid foods that trigger nausea, such as spicy, greasy, or heavy meals. Opt for bland, easily digestible foods, such as crackers, toast, or rice. Stay hydrated. Sip on clear fluids, such as water, ginger ale, or herbal teas, to prevent dehydration. Avoid large amounts of fluid intake in one sitting. Consider ginger or peppermint. These natural remedies, available in the form of tea, candies, or supplements, may help alleviate nausea. Consult with your healthcare provider before trying any herbal remedies. Take anti-nausea medications as prescribed. Your healthcare provider may prescribe medications to prevent or manage nausea. Follow their instructions carefully and notify them if the medications are not providing relief. Infusion Reaction Management Inform your healthcare provider. It is important to communicate any previous infusion reactions or known allergies to your healthcare team before starting rituximab treatment. Prepare for infusions. 
Your healthcare provider may administer medications, such as antihistamines or corticosteroids, before your infusion to minimize the risk of infusion reactions. Monitor for symptoms. Pay close attention to any unusual symptoms during and after the infusion. If you experience symptoms such as fever, chills, rash, itching, or difficulty breathing, inform your healthcare provider immediately. Follow post-infusion instructions. Your healthcare provider may provide specific instructions regarding post-infusion care, such as taking certain medications or avoiding certain activities. Adhering to these instructions can help minimize the risk of infusion reactions. Less common but serious side effects. While uncommon, it is important to be aware of the less common but serious side effects that may occur during rituximab treatment. These side effects require immediate medical attention and should not be ignored. Although rare, it is crucial to recognize and understand these potential complications to ensure timely intervention. Serious Infections Rituximab can suppress the immune system, increasing the risk of serious infections. If you develop symptoms of an infection, such as fever, persistent cough, sore throat, or unusual fatigue, seek immediate medical attention. Prompt treatment with appropriate antibiotics or antiviral medications can help prevent complications. Heart and Lung Problems In rare cases, rituximab may cause heart or lung problems. Symptoms may include chest pain, shortness of breath, rapid heartbeat, or swelling in the legs. If you experience any of these symptoms, notify your healthcare provider immediately for further evaluation and management. Blood Disorders Rituximab can affect blood cell production, leading to potential blood disorders. You should promptly report any signs of excessive bleeding, easy bruising, or unusual fatigue to your healthcare provider. Regular blood tests may be necessary to monitor your blood cell counts during rituximab treatment. It is important to remember that serious side effects are rare, and the benefits of rituximab treatment often outweigh the risks. However, being aware of these potential complications and promptly reporting any concerning symptoms to your healthcare provider can ensure timely intervention if needed. Tips for coping with side effects during rituximab treatment Managing side effects during rituximab treatment involves a holistic approach that encompasses physical, emotional, and practical strategies. Here are some tips to help you cope with side effects and maintain a positive mindset throughout your treatment journey. Build a support network. Seek support from family, friends, or support groups who can provide emotional and practical assistance during your treatment. Having a strong support network can make a significant difference in your overall well-being and help alleviate some of the burdens associated with side effects. Practice self-care. Make self-care a priority during your treatment journey. Engage in activities that bring you joy and relaxation, such as reading, listening to music, practicing mindfulness, or taking soothing baths. Taking care of your mental and emotional well-being can help you better cope with the challenges of treatment. Communicate openly with your healthcare team. Maintain open and honest communication with your healthcare team about your side effects. They can provide guidance, adjust your treatment plan if necessary, and offer support throughout your journey. Remember, you are an active participant in your treatment, and your input is essential for optimal care. Follow a healthy lifestyle. Adopting a healthy lifestyle can support your overall well-being during treatment. Eat a balanced diet, engage in regular physical activity within your capabilities, and get enough sleep. These lifestyle choices can help boost your immune system, improve energy levels, and enhance your overall quality of life. Seek professional support. If you find it challenging to cope with the side effects on your own, seeking professional support can be beneficial. Mental health professionals, such as counselors or therapists, can provide guidance and support to help you navigate the emotional challenges of your treatment journey. Remember, everyone's treatment journey is unique, and what works for one person may not work for another. Explore different coping strategies, and don't hesitate to reach out for help when needed. With the right support and self-care practices, you can navigate your rituximab treatment journey with resilience and positivity. Communicating with your healthcare team about side effects. Open and effective communication with your healthcare team is crucial in managing side effects during rituximab treatment. Here are some tips to help facilitate productive conversations with your healthcare provider. Keep a symptom diary. Maintain a symptom diary to track and document any side effects you experience. Include details such as the date, time, duration, and severity of the symptoms. This information can help provide a comprehensive overview of your side effects and assist your healthcare team in determining the best course of action. Ask questions. Don't hesitate to ask questions or seek clarification about your treatment, potential side effects, or any concerns you may have. 
Understanding your treatment plan and its potential risks and benefits can help you make informed decisions and alleviate any anxieties. Be honest and open. Be honest and open about your side effects with your healthcare provider. Describe your symptoms accurately, including their intensity and any impact on your daily activities. This information will enable your healthcare team to tailor your treatment plan and provide appropriate support. Advocate for yourself. You are your best advocate when it comes to your health. If you feel that your side effects are not adequately addressed or if you have concerns about your treatment, don't hesitate to speak up and express your needs. Your healthcare team is there to support you and ensure you receive the best possible care. Remember, effective communication is a two-way street. Be an active participant in your treatment journey by sharing your experiences, asking questions, and collaborating with your healthcare team to optimize your care. Supportive care options for managing side effects. In addition to self-care practices, there are various supportive care options available to help manage side effects during rituximab treatment. These options, often provided by healthcare professionals, can help alleviate symptoms and improve your overall well-being. Here are some supportive care options to consider. Nutritional support. Consulting with a registered dietitian can help you develop a personalized nutrition plan to manage side effects such as nausea or changes in appetite. They can provide guidance on selecting nutrient-dense foods and incorporating dietary modifications that suit your specific needs. Physical therapy. Physical therapy can be beneficial for managing side effects such as muscle weakness, joint pain, or mobility issues. A physical therapist can design an exercise program tailored to your abilities and provide techniques to improve strength, flexibility, and overall physical function. Pain management. If you experience pain as a side effect of rituximab treatment, a pain management specialist can help develop a comprehensive pain management plan. This may include a combination of medications, physical therapy, acupuncture, or other therapies to alleviate pain and improve your overall comfort. Emotional and psychological support. Facing side effects during treatment can take a toll on your emotional well-being. Seeking support from psychologists, counselors, or support groups can provide a safe space to express your feelings, learn coping strategies, and find emotional support from others going through similar experiences. Discuss these supportive care options with your healthcare team to determine which ones may be most beneficial for managing your specific side effects. Remember, supportive care is designed to complement your treatment plan and improve your overall quality of life during rituximab treatment. Personal stories and experiences with rituximab side effects. Hearing personal stories and experiences from individuals who have undergone rituximab treatment can provide valuable insights and support. While everyone's journey is unique, these stories can help you feel less alone and provide practical tips for managing side effects. Below are a few examples. Sarah's story. Sarah, a lymphoma survivor, shares her experience with rituximab treatment. She discusses how she managed fatigue by incorporating short walks into her routine, practicing meditation for stress reduction, and seeking support from her loved ones. Sarah emphasizes the importance of self-care and maintaining a positive mindset throughout her treatment journey. Mark's journey. Mark, diagnosed with rheumatoid arthritis, shares his journey with rituximab treatment. He discusses how he coped with nausea by following dietary recommendations, taking anti-nausea medications as prescribed, and seeking guidance from his healthcare provider. Mark's story highlights the importance of open communication with healthcare professionals and the value of self-advocacy. Emily's experience. Emily, a patient with lupus, shares her experience with infusion reactions during rituximab treatment. She discusses how she recognized the symptoms of a mild infusion reaction and informed her healthcare provider promptly. Emily emphasizes the importance of being vigilant and proactive in managing potential side effects. Reading personal stories and experiences can provide inspiration, practical tips, and a sense of community during your rituximab treatment journey. Remember, everyone's experience is unique, and it is essential to consult with your healthcare team for personalized advice and guidance.